the thing about MIDI tracks is that these notes are playing, but if you click on the word strum at the side there, you will then see this is the instrument that's making the sound. So let me so let me just solo this strum track. If I wanted to change the instrument, I could change it to a piano. So I go to sound and I type in piano. And I can actually type in piano right at the top there. Yeah? And it will find me all the pianos. Let's say um, dance piano. Okay. I drop in dance piano. So you play instead of playing the strum, you end up playing a piano instead. Right? So now you can replace instruments because the notes are stored differently from the instrument. This way also, if you try out the sound and you don't like it, you can always change the sound. Go back in and change the sound. And let's say the drums. If I solo the drums, solo the drums. Start here. Okay, maybe I think, ah, that drum not very impressive. Let me click on the drum set. By the way, now, now it's a bit weird, huh? because I still have the word piano on top, right? So I need to actually remove the word piano. Otherwise, you'll be looking for me all the all the drum sets that have piano. Yeah, that's kind of weird. So what I'm going to do is then I remove piano. Ah, now I can see proper drum kits. Find a drum kit. Find a drum kit that's maybe more um, like a drum machine. Okay. And then now I've got, oh yes, there are these like famous drum machines of the EDM scene. Maybe the 909. Okay, I'm gonna take it and I drag it into the drums. So now the sound of the drums is gonna be different. So I change the drums. Okay, on this, I solo the drums. Sounds different now, right? Okay, so for all of these tracks that are MIDI tracks where you can see notes, you can actually change the instruments. So go ahead and try changing the instruments on your own, right? The ones which you cannot change the instrument are those where instead of notes, you see a waveform, which is this one. Look at this one. The vocal is actually a waveform there. It's not notes. And if it's not notes, that means you cannot change the, uh, you know, it is it's actually recorded. It's actually a wave file or MP3 file. Yeah. But for the others where the notes are stored, you can actually change the instrument. So go ahead. Try. You got this entire piece there. You don't like how they made the music. Just change the instruments. Go and search for instruments. Remember, after you type in something like, you know, um, maybe you type in guitar, right? To search. Always clear it before you search for your next one. Okay. Like this one, drum kit. Ah, okay. So unclick also. So go ahead and try, change the instrument sounds. Sorry, once you found an instrument, like say sounds, let's say I found something like a synth, right? Um, I need to drag it into the, into the front of the track. Can you see where my cursor is? I've dragged it into this point here. Okay, so I dragged it from the list here and I dragged it over here where the track name is. I have no idea what I just did. So what I just added. So let's hear what the strum now sounds like. The strum now sounds like. Well, I think that sounds better. 